Hi, I'm Mira from Flow with Mira. Today's full body workout mat class is going to be done half standing and half on a mat. So let's go ahead, let's begin the class. So let's stand with the feet parallel, hip width apart, standing nice and tall. We're going to start with some roll downs. So take an in breath. As we exhale, so dip the neck down and start rolling through the spine, softening through the knees, articulating the spine down. And then bring the pelvis forward and then bring yourself closer to the floor. Inhale, exhale, let's roll up and start stacking up the spine, bringing the pelvis vertical and the lumbar spine, the middle back, the upper back and the neck and the head comes last. In breath. Exhale, nodding the head down and rolling through the spine. Try to get as much flexion as you can. And bring the pelvis forward. Inhale at the bottom. And then exhale, let's roll the spine up. Vertebrae by vertebrae. And the head comes last. One more, inhale. And exhale, rolling down. Take yourself all the way down to the floor. Relax the shoulder, relax the head, relax the neck. And then grounding through the feet and roll the spine up. Let's just go halfway here and then place your hands on your thighs, softening the knee. I want you to elongate the spine tall, reaching out the pelvis and the head away from each other. And then take your arms up next to your ears. So you are in a sort of like a squat position here. And then stay here. Bring the arms back for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let go of the arms, rounding the back and rolling up through the spine, coming up nice and tall. Well done. Okay, we're gonna do some footwork. So standing footwork. Have your feet again in hip width distance apart, parallel position, and then stack one arm and the other one in front of you here. Inhale, as we go down, I like you to create a nice long spine here. Exhale, straighten. Inhale, the knee moves forward and the pelvis descend down, but the spine stay nice and long. Exhale. Inhale, down, exhale, and in breath, exhale, again, four more, in breath, and three, center is on, two, and last, now stay here, let's do a little pulse, so halfway up, And 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I want to straighten the legs all the way up. Well done. Cross your arm the other way. Rise up to the ball of the feet. So go onto tippy toe here. Now here, hold that feet. Inhale, we bend. Exhale. In breath. Exhale. And three. So this series is normally done on the Pilates equipment, but I'm transferring it to a mat class. So we're doing it standing. Exhale. Whoop, lost my balance. Three more. Two. One. Let's go down again for little pulses. And up. And ten. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Straighten the legs all the way and come on down. Well done. Switch your arms, go into a V position. So heels are together. Your legs are in external rotation. And then rise up. So tippy toes again. And we go down in breath. Exhale. Make sure the thigh goes over your feet. And 
four, and five, and six. Center is on, and seven, three more, eight, nine, and ten. Let's go down, little pulses, up. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Straighten all the way. Well done. And come on down. Open your heels slightly wider than the pelvis and take your arms out to the side. Here we go. Inhale. Exhale. Two. And three. Keep the spine nice and tall here and four, and five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Little pulses again. We go up, and two, and three, and four, and five, and one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Straighten everything up. Well done. Just bring the feet a little closer to the tongue a little bit and rise up to your tippy toes. And let's do it again. And down. Keep the heels up. And two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, two more, nine, and ten. And we go down little pulses for fifteen. One, and two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Another five, four, three, two, one. One, straighten everything up. Well done. And come on down. Shake it up a little bit. And let's go to parallel feet position. Cross the arms again. Let's go into your calf raises. So rise up onto the tall tippy toes, ball of the feet. And drawing up the center as you lower. Again, lift up two. And lower. Lift up three. And lower. Lift up four. And five. And six, and seven, eight, two more, nine, hold the last one, ten, stay. Let's go to prancing, lower one heel, keep the pelvis stable, lift and lower, lift and lower, and lower, we go, inhale, exhale, inhale, Exhale, in breath, exhale, in breath, last set, exhale, in breath, and rising up tall, lower the heels, well done, excellent, let's do single here, so we can have your hands on your hip if you like, for a better balance here, or you can have your hands like what I'm doing. Okay, you know what? Let's take your hands here, actually. Place your hands at the back of your head and change my mind. You can also have your hands here. Now, take the right leg up off the floor and balance on the left. And we send the knee forward and then lift up through the spine. And we go down. So you're probably mirroring me. So you have your left leg up. I have my right leg up. Then you're balancing on your right leg. In. Exhale. Again. And five, four, three, two, one, and let that go. Let's switch. Bring your right leg up, left leg for me, and balance onto your left, right leg for me. And we go. Two. Three, four, five, 
six, make sure your foot is parallel, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Well done. Let that go. Shake those legs. All right. Take a deep breath. I'm just going to face the side for you. Let's do one roll down again. Exhale. You're welcome to face me. I'm just facing to the side for the sake of the camera here. Take yourself all the way down. In breath. Exhale. Go halfway up. Place your hands onto your thigh, softening the knees, send the pelvis back, take your back, your spine into a nice long neutral spine. Let's go into a cat stretch here. We breathe that. We round the back. <sighs> Inhale, lengthen the spine, reach through the upper back, coming up into an extension. And exhale. <sighs> and in breath, upper back. And exhale. <sighs> In breath and upper back extension. Two more times. Exhale and in breath. Last one. Exhale and in breath. Upper back extension and rounding the back. Let go of the arms. Roll up through the spine. Come up tall and standing nice and tall. And let's go ahead. We're going to take the right leg up to off the floor again. So your right leg up will be my left. <laughs> Interlace your hands behind your head. Now from here, I want you to rotate towards your right. Find your balance and we go double breath. Shh, shh, inhale, center. And with twist. Shh, shh, inhale, center. You can also have your hands on your hip if you like. Shh, shh, and center. One more set. The last one. Center. Let it go. Let's pick up the other leg. So you got your left leg, my right leg. And let's go to your left. And center. Find your balance. Lifting tall. Center. One more set. Last one, come back center and let that go. Relax and shake your leg. I'm gonna go to my mat here. All right, let's take your right leg forward for lunge series and have your left one behind here. Open your arms up to the T positioned. Get a vertical alignment on the front leg from the knee to your heel and stretch your back leg as far as you can. Tuck the toes under. From here, I like you to scoop the belly in, curl the pelvis under and bend the back knee. Tap it down. And then reach through the back leg, straighten. And four more, down, inhale. Exhale, and three. Exhale, and two. Exhale, and one. Exhale, stay. Take your hands down to the floor. Release the back heel down. Doris, you flex the front foot straight in the front leg. I like you to elongate the spine as long as much as you can. And stay here for your hamstring stretch. In breath. Exhale. In breath. Exhale. Two more breath. Last breath. Release the front foot. Bring the front foot to the back and a switch leg. Come back to a lunge position again. Align the front knee and the heel. Stretch your right leg, your back leg as far as you can and arms out to the T position. We scoop the belly in, curl the pelvis and take the knee down. And then reach back. Four more. And down. And then reach back. And down. Two more. Last one. Stay. Hands down, release the back heel, dorsiflex the front foot. 
Lengthen through the spine. Neck is long. Stay here. In breath. For the hamstring stretch, exhale. And in breath. Exhale. And. One more breath. And release that. Take the front foot to the back. And get yourself to an up stretch position. So lift the heels up. Lengthen through the tailbone and the sitting bone. Press the floor away. Neck is long. Now from here, let's descend the heels down. To get a bigger stretch to the back of your legs here. We stay here, pressing the armpit to the floor. In breath. So you engage your latissimus dorsi. Exhale. Inhale, I like you to pick up the abdominal wall and try to keep working on sending the sitting bone away from the wall, diagonally away from the arms. Exhale, one more time. Exhale, and good. Bend the knees, take the knees down to the floor, sit down and bring the legs forward in front of you. All right, legs together. Arms forward, moving on to your hundreds here. So we curl the belly in, roll back, and roll down, roll down, and sit and point, take the legs up to the tabletop position, arms long by the side. Stretch your legs long to the ceiling, in breath. Exhale, we pump, and inhale, and exhale. And inhale, you're also welcome to lower the legs. And inhale. And. And five. And four. And. That was six, by the way. This is seven. Terrible counting today. And. And nine. And last. And stay, drag the knees in, drag it, drag it, drag it. Grab the shin just above the ankle. Drop the feet down a little bit, curl the spine and roll yourself up to rolling like a ball. All right, balancing on your tailbone. Lock your arms in, look down to the pelvis. And we inhale, exhale. In breath, exhale, keep the shape of the body, inhale, exhale, go up and over, in breath, exhale, up and over, three more, two, one, and stay, well done, straighten the legs. All right, legs together, take the arms over the legs, C curve, ready for the roll up. So we're going to roll back for the roll up. So roll back first and take your arms overhead. Now we're going to inhale to lift up, chest lift. Exhale, pull that center in, round your body up and over forward, in breath. Exhale, roll back through the spine. Arms overhead. Again, inhale, lift. Exhale. Come up and over. In breath. Exhale. Roll back. And arms overhead. Two more times. Inhale, lift. Exhale. We come up. Inhale, stay. Exhale. We go down. And arms overhead. One last one. Inhale, lift. Exhale. We come up. In breath, hold. Exhale. We go down. Take the arms overhead and circle them down by the side of your body. Bend the knees. Bring the feet closer towards your bottom. All right, let's do one pelvic curl. Make sure your feet are hip width distance apart. Curling up all the way to the bridge. Press up and open the front of your hips here. Then we exhale, roll down through the spine. And release the pelvis down. And then we come up again. Let's go into shoulder bridge prep. We roll up through the spine. 
press the left foot, take the right leg up to tabletop, maintain the stability of the pelvis. We tap, and up, we tap. Let's do eight of these, three, and four, and five, and six, and seven. Last eight, we hold, lower the pelvis and a little bit, pulse it up for eight, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, hold, lower the foot down, reestablish the pelvis position. Let's take the other leg up to tabletop and we tap, up, and two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, last eight, hold up, pulses in, and two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight, hold up, take the foot down, reestablish the pelvis position, and let's articulate the spine down. Good job. All right, straighten the arm and the leg closer to me, overhead and down by you. Turn your body, face me, come up onto your forearm, bend the knees together for me, please. Make sure your feet are in line with the spine here, take the top arm over. Suspend the ribs up to the ceiling, lengthen through the spine here. Keep the pelvis stable, open the knee for the clamp. And down, and two, and down. Hold this up here, we don't want to sway down. Three, and open two more. And the last one, and stay. I like it to lift the pelvis up, and let's repeat that for another 10. And two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, ten, open, release, and lower, and change side. All right, we've got the forearm, arm placement, lift to the underneath side, take the top arm up, and we open for five here. Two, lift the waistline up, three, four, five, and we lift the pelvis up, open, 10, and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Last 10, well done, and release that onto a quadruped position here. Okay, hold that center for me, please. Pick up the belly, tuck your toes under, align the shoulder and the heel of the palm, knee in the center of your hip joint. And we drop the belly, float the knees, neck is long, step. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one, and well done. Release the ankle, take the right arm forward. Take the left one behind, left leg behind you. Stabilize your center, lift the arm and the leg up. And down, two, and down, three, four, five, six, Two more, seven, last and hold that position and just lift up another eight for pulses. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight and lower, switch side. Left arm forward, right leg back behind you, center nice and switched on. We lift the arm and the leg. And two, on three. On four, five, six, two more. Last one, hold it up, pulses eight, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Coming down and release. Okay, 
All right, let's go to some tricep push up here. Drawing the abdominal muscle in, send the elbows back and then just hinge yourself forward. And we push and hinge down and we press. Keep the scapula away from each other. Three, press, hinge forward, four, press, and shoulders over your hands and go forward in front of your hands, more like it. Four more. Three. Two. Last here. Press up. Well done. Cat stretches, please. We breathe out, we round the back. Rounding, so good to run back after those exercises and lengthen through the spine upward with the upper back and round back. Lengthen through the spine upward and two more times, please. Exhale and one more rounding the back, pulling the abdominal muscle in. Lengthening through the spine, arching the upper back, hold the lower abs and release. Well done. Down to the floor, onto your belly for your double leg kick. Turn your head towards me. Interlace your hands and place them in the small of the back. Legs are together. And from here, float the legs off the floor. We exhale. Three, two, one. Inhale, reach the leg long. Hands off your bottom, spine is long, head over to the other side and repeat. <sighs> Inhale, reach long. Again, exhale. <sighs> Inhale, reach long. Exhale. <sighs> Inhale, reach long. Exhale. <sighs> Inhale, reach long. Exhale. <sighs> And inhale, reach long. Last set here. Inhale, reach long. Last one. And reach, reach, hold. Lower down. Bring the forearm to the side of your body, please. Fit together down on the floor. What a little baby swan. And inhale, lengthening up. Exhale, coming down. And inhale, reach through the spine. Exhale, two more times, please. Inhale, forearm down. Lift the upper back as far as you can. Gaze is down to the floor still. And down. Last one. Inhaling. Exhaling down. Let's go to a breaststroke here. So, as you lift the back, lift the forearm. Straighten the arms. Open to the side, bend the elbows and lower down. And inhale, lift. Out to the side, exhale, bend and lower. Inhale, lift. And side, bend the elbows and come down. Keep the external rotation of the shoulder. Lift. Last one here, guys. Inhale, reach. Arms to the side, elbows bend, come on down, well down. Push the floor away with the forearm, round the back, and you can relax now. In breath, just shake the pelvis, sway left and right. Loosen up the lower back, the back muscle. Use your breath out. To soften your body down to the floor. <sighs> okay, that was the last exercise for today, everybody. And an exhale, let's roll the spine up through and coming up to a beautiful seated position. One long inhalation with me. Exhale, melting. Softening the body, yet staying strong and grounded to your center. <sighs> Thank you.
for joining me today and I wish you a lovely day.